All right, today is Saturday, April 9th. Do a quick update here. Uh, I'm going to go in the same order I've been doing the last two updates so you can uh, hopefully see the difference in the plants. Here's our radish uh, wicking bed. These have definitely grown compared to last week. Uh, I think these actually just might be ready to go ahead and pull out and, and eat. Uh, turning over here to the watermelon gravel bed. This one has shown a lot of uh, leafy growth over the last week. Uh, I mean, you can barely see the bed now. I think if you go back and look at the video, you'll notice quite a bit of growth uh, just in the last week. Here are two of our watermelons. Again, I haven't measured these. It's grown since last week. How much, I don't know. This one's not growing as quickly, this smaller one. And then there's a third one. Here it is over here. That one's grown in the last week. A uh, little bit the fastest growing one is this one, for sure. So we'll see what these come out to look like in another week or so and, and what they taste like. Over here, uh, my celery is being covered by the watermelon, but it's doing okay. It's got a little bit of, uh, of uh, tip burn over here. I'm not sure what that's caused by. The watermelon, you can see it just kind of getting out of control there. And there are a few more uh, watermelons coming out, so that'll be great. Can't wait. Over here in this uh, gravel bed, this zucchini plant has just exploded in the last week. Look at that. Look at all that growth. It's nice and green. And down here, we do have some, uh, sorry about that. We do have some zucchinis coming out there at the bottom. Uh, the rest of this bed, I've got to get some more things planted in here. I cleaned this area out last week. I took out I, uh, one of the basil, purple basil plants because it was just getting out of control. But this other one, these other two stayed. Those are fine. Uh, then in this gravel bed, the cucumber plant is gone. Got rid of that last week. I think this little cherry tomato plant's gonna have to go. Uh, it doesn't seem, it, it seems like whatever happened to it, it's not gonna recover. So we've got some planning to do in this bed. Uh, let me just take you quickly over here. These are the lettuces I planted two weeks ago that I bought at the store, and they're doing they're doing quite well. Um, this is the first set of lettuces that have done well in the raft system. I mean, they're, they look green, they look healthy, they're growing, they're not bolting, so that's great, great news. The, these are the lettuces that have been in the system for a very long time that look awful, they've bolted, um, and of course I'm just going to throw those out. But the good news is these lettuces are looking great. Um, over here in this raft, I've got two more watermelon plants that um, haven't greened up. They're growing, but they haven't greened up. I've got these chives, and uh, all of the cilantro I planted in here died. But the chives are looking good, and the watermelon looks good. And then here, this wicking bed's got the asparagus in it that continues to look fine. So that's about it. 